Hello, hello, hello YouTube and welcome to another player review video. In this video I'm going to be reviewing Lorenzo Pellegrini. He's, he's just a discard informer, decided to try out along with every other informer in his team. Like, apart from the goalie, but... I, I don't know. Apart from the goalie. Look at those stats. Seven games, four goals, three assists. He's just stupidly good. But before we get into it, if you do like this video, please leave a like, subscribe if your nan's dead, and comment down below who, what player you want me to review next. Because I'm looking more like at budget players so everyone can try them. Because not everyone's got, like, four, I'd say I've got, I've got 400k, maybe like 450k. Not everyone's got that. So, trading video coming soon, by the way. Make sure you keep an eye out for that. It's not. I'm lazy. I can't be bothered recording it. But yeah, let's get into it. Uh, Lorenzo Pellegrini. I did just buy him because I wanted someone to link to Lucas. This is the team I'm using about him, by the way. I've done a play review on Lucas and Guardian. So if you haven't seen them, make sure you go check them out. And I'm after this, I'm going to record one on Chexera once I learn how to pronounce his name. I'm going to do a play review on him as well because it's just a video, isn't it? <laughs> But yeah, I've do you have a castless cam style on him just because he's playing as a wide cam, so I do want to up his pace. And Hunter's is expensive. Shadow's a bit of a waste because he's already got 75 defending. I know he's got higher passing, but passing's more relevant in a wide cam. I say I'm playing him in a four triple two. Passing's more relevant in a wide cam than defending is. So yeah, three star, three star. I, that's probably one of the only downfalls with this one. He, he lacks another star in one of those categories. If he had another star, then you'll make him a lot better. He's, he's only young as well. Didn't know that. Ninety six. He's just under a year older than me. But if you look at the price of going for eleven thousand five hundred, he's probably raised like twelve k, twelve five, pro probably even fourteen k now. But he's still worth it. Look at those. It's lowest at seventy two. Which is shooting, and that's just a lie. It's, it's it's not that bad. Look at the look at the games. Seven games, four goals, three assists. That's stupid for a wide cam. It, it medium medium work rates. It's, it's you, you don't know some. I I think work rates is just a myth, just like women's rights. It just it makes no sense. But anyway, let's get into the player himself, into the in-game stats. I'm going to talk them through one by one. Um. And just give you the not really an in-depth analysis because I'm lazy. So just skim through them and just tell you. Just get a fast video out. So because you don't want to be sitting here for like 20 minutes to me tell you. Oh, he's very good. Bam. That's that's something like Jordan or James would do. So don't want to do that. It, but his pace. I've got a catalyst on him. So what would that make his pace? 91 acceleration, 87 swim speed. So he is really fast. And you do no standing game. Without it, I, I think I put a catalyst on when I bought. I can't really remember using them without a catalyst. So if you use them, I probably use them. He works really well as a Y cam though. Like I wouldn't even want to change him into a central cam. But if you want to do that, because I know not a lot of people use the four triple two. It's like four one two one two four three three four four two and that. But if you look, he's an all-round player, so you could just use him as a sentiment, even possibly a CDM. Just put a sentinel on him or an anchor, and you've got one of the best cards in the game there. Um, yeah, so that's his pace. His shooting, as I say, 65 finishing. Why are you lying, EA? Why are you lying? You're just lying, aren't you? Like the McCanns. His, his finishing is probably 80 85, something like that. Because as you can tell by his goal to game ratio, stupid. His long shots are incredible. His curve, 79 that I go to. Yeah, yeah, it does let him down a bit. It doesn't feel that high, to be honest with you. Because when you try your finesse shots, sometimes he gets the curve on him, sometimes he do I don't know whether that's a composure thing, but he has got 85 composure, which is just stupid. So. I don't know why that is. It is a bit inconsistent, but I think it's just this game because we all know EA make the most consistent games ever. But yeah, they're consistently shit. So yeah, it's but pass the rest of his passing stats just look stupid, don't they? Let's be honest. 
and with this chem style it's plus 15 on crossing plus 15 on vision plus 5 on short passing free kick actually just get someone else to take the free kicks got loads of people in the scene to take free. I can think Hernanez got stupid free yeah 80 probably 95 free kick actually with that chem style on uh, so I've got other people to take it Freddy Guardians another good one as well I think Hang on, let me just check that before I shout at myself when I watch it. Yeah, 93, fucking hell. But it, yeah, back to Pellegrini. His, his passing is a bit manual, so I don't really want to get into that. His dribbling feels stupidly good. 85 ball control, 81 dribbling, you really do feel that. It Maybe if you put an engine on, engine might be a better suit for him, to be honest with you, but I bought the catalyst put it on him. His defending, you don't really, it, obviously he's a wide cam so you don't notice it. Having said that, you do notice Guardian's defending, so I don't know whether that's I play more down the right side and I don't notice it left, or it's just Pellegrini's not as good as Guardian is defending. So I'd have to try him at TDM to just really get a grip of his defending to tell you what it's like. But physical uh, he's, he's he's a bit weak. His st stamina is okay. Like it's not not great, not bad. It's just average. His aggression seventy five. As I said, it's average. If you want to put a sentinel and just up his defending physical, if you play him in CDM, maybe an anchor. Maybe you want to put an anchor on. Hang on. Let me just get me water because. <laughs> I hope you heard that, and I hope you didn't like it. But anyway, yeah, that's, that's the player review done. It's, he is a really good player going forwards, but I haven't used him as a DM. So if anyone's used him as a DM, make sure you tell me what he's like in the comment section down below. And yeah, out of 10, what would I rate him? Going forwards, 7.5, maybe 8. But tracking back, probably a 5, maybe. Four. No, I'm not rating him a 4 probably a five coming back but he's a wide cam so I don't notice him coming back but if you compare him to Freddy Guardian you do notice Guardian coming back so I don't know whether that's just people play down a right more or Pellegrini's not as good as him but price wise you might as well pick him up he's like 12k you might as well for the player you're getting the quality player you're getting like look at those stats, they're just stupid. And he plays a lot better than he looks in game as well. And he looks stupidly good. <laughs> it's gay now. He is fit though. Anyway, if you do like the video, please leave a like. Subscribe if your nan's dead. Comment down below who you want me to review next. And see ya, goodbye.